I'm Suman from Innovate, and today we are talking to Amit Jain, who's the founder and CEO of Prism Systems. Hi, Amit. Welcome to the show. Nice to meet with you, Suman. Thank you. I'm so excited to be here too. The first question that I have for you is, you founded this amazing company. Uh, tell us something about your journey through your education and what led to the starting of Prism. Well, it's a long story, but I'll try my best. Uh, I have uh, really three technical degrees and that really wow. gave me uh, kind of a core strength to where I am today. I have physics background that really made me understand the basics of technology to implementation by doing electrical engineering and then laser and optical engineering. So really, I went a long way studying and uh, then got into business and uh, business school. And once I did that, I said, I got to do my own startups. And so very early in my life, I started doing startups. Uh, first uh, company I did was in data storage mm -hmm. and uh, making a high capacity optical disk drive. And why am I saying that? It's because it uses a laser that we use today in our current product. Mm -hmm. Then I got into telecom business where we were doing high speed transmission. And high speed transmission means also we are doing high speed modulation in the current product. And uh, the third uh, company I did was in Datacom where you are sending mass amount of uh, data. And it's the same thing on a display, you're printing mass amount of data. So really uh, my life history has culminated into Prism as a company. Great. So you would say that education does play a big role as opposed to what we listen, you know, saying degrees, it's okay. And I think with so much of rich experience that you have in your industry, I think it's not a surprise that you've not just co-founded a company that sells large format displays, but you are also the co-inventor of uh, the technology behind it, which is laser phosphor. So tell us more about it. What are the benefits? Yeah, laser phosphor display uh, is invented by Prism. Uh, and uh, it has, we have 200 patents, uh, issued patents, and we control it, manage it globally. It's very important to say that it's invented in US uh, by uh, Prism and we control it worldwide. Uh, it's a big deal from the concept of laser phosphor display to the product, to manufacturing process, whole nine yards. So uh, what is LPD is very simple. It's a laser. Uh, which is scanning and turning on one pixel at a time of phosphor. So phosphor coated screen turning on by remotely wirelessly controlled lasers. And uh, there is a feedback system built in that allows to measure the brightness and color <laughs> of every pixel to maintain uniformity over life. When you have large displays and you have millions of pixels, it's almost impossible to maintain uniformity. We guarantee 99% uniformity. That's a big deal. Three other very key features of our display that uh, LPD basic concept allows you is it's, it's very low in power uh, and power consumption is going to become bigger and bigger deal as climate changes are happening and, uh, and larger format displays consume a lot of power. So it's a big deal. Day one, uh, we focus on very low power consumption. That's a big deal. And the second is uh, mass manufacturing globally at a very low capex. Uh, other display technology require billions of dollars in capex. We require millions of dollars in capex. So it's uh, order of magnitude, uh, three orders of magnitude uh, lower cost. Mm -hmm. And uh, obviously, uh, then the third part is our display is only good when there's amazing image quality. Absolutely. And that's what we offer. So what I hear is the technology not just makes the images better, but also lead to less consumption of energy, which of course is a huge deal when it comes to the impact it has on the planet. I think that's, that's, right. that's amazing. Probably offline we would you know, like discuss more about it. Cool. So you're not just uh, manufacturing the world's largest single panel display, but you're also integrating it with collaborative software. Right. So, so how does that work? Uh, yeah, let me uh, talk uh, about immersiveness of the dis display first and that will link to the software. So uh, what we thought about for a display is it must be good up close. You're one feet away or you could be 20, 30, 50 feet away. Large format display people think watch from far away. No, we believe you can be up close or far away. To do that, we have very high resolution. What we call something called very high fill factor. Uh, that is almost like a printed paper when you are up close. And, and the third part is uh, it is a very high contrast. 
and high contrast give deep immersive image quality. So by doing that, when you're up close or far away, we said, why don't we add interactivity? So we have all our displays are large touch screens. So it can be 10 feet, 20 feet long, but it's all touch screen. Once we did the immersive uh, aspect of the touch screen, then we said, well, what good is this display if you don't have an application to really utilize in daily life? So you have to have total solutions. So then we developed a software platform that allows you on a large display to bring multiple content simultaneously on the screen because it's very, uh, human mind is very sharp. You can have many, many content. You can assimilate all at once and make better decisions much quickly. And if you're doing one thing at a time and it's a very slow process, so our large format display allows you to bring lots of content simultaneously, interact with them, and it's great presentation tool in room. We took it to the whole new level saying that why can't people across the world having our displays in different locations interact simultaneously and at the same time as if they're in the same room. Wow. And so everybody can add, edit, interact with all the contents from all remote locations simultaneously. So then we added something called Launch Plus okay. that allows you to bring unified communications like Team, like Zoom, like WebEx or wow. anything else. Okay. So you can also have voice and video using pre-installed already uh, uh, technologies that you use in the company. And so we don't uh, block other technologies, we integrate them, but most importantly, the hyper interactivity between multiple locations is only possible because of our software. Mm -hmm. And it only works because you have a large format display, so right. you are actually able to see all the content and not minuscule little content that you can't make sense of. I think it's a whole different experience. Whole different experience. That Display guys only think of display, software guys only think of software. We really believe in total solution. So you brought all the technologies together. together. Yeah, and I think that's great because as consumers, we always need more, want more, and see how we can get the best of it. So I think your technology is connecting people across the world in a, in a very unique manner. And it comes out with many use cases and many ways to use this and they find productivity improvements, they find decision-making improvements, they find uh, kind of bringing people up to speed very quickly, training and education. So people are finding more and more use cases even than before we imagined. Fantastic. So as exciting as it sounds, I think now Prism Systems has a new global partner and I think a lot of new things are on the horizon. So tell us a little bit more about what are the exciting things that we expect from PRISM in the future, especially since it concerns the APAC region? Yeah, so I'm really excited to say that uh, we really uh, established a very strong strategic partnership with a India-based company called Motherson. And they're a very large uh, company. They have global footprint. They are in, uh, what, uh, uh, 41 plus com uh, countries with 140 plus manufacturing lines. Why am I bringing that out? Because PRISM displays needs to be manufactured globally, close to customers. And Mother can really help us scale manufacturing faster than, uh, uh, than uh, we imagined. And in fact, we can set up uh, factories in APAC, which is a very important region uh, in India, for example, yeah. and, and scale manufacturing very easily because CapEx is very low. Yeah. So we can establish that. And that strength of manufacturing, supply chain, uh, will really accelerate the end customer reach for us. And that's a big deal. And I'm also excited to say that Prism has gone through many phases of uh, product development, generation one and two, and I'm very excited that soon uh, we'll be coming out with newer generations of product wow. and yeah. pushing both the display technology as well as the software. And so really, not just software, not just display, but as a total solution. And we truly believe in that and we live up to that and we will wow the world with new generations of technology.